Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Saturday, August 29th, 2020. The tarot card for today is the Ace of Cups, or Lotus, from the Botanical Tarot. Now, I'll tell you what, what a good day we have going on here. All right, I, some of you follow me, I'm going to sidetrack for a second here, over on Patreon, and I do weekly readings there, and monthly, etc., and there are always longer ones. And when I did the one for this week, I spoke of Mother Nature and her really acting up this week. All right, here in the U.S., I had mentioned midweek, we have fires, we have hurricanes, and we're going to begin to get past all of that and look on the bright side of things today. So I really like, this is my favorite card, by the way, the Ace of Cups, okay? Because it represents fulfillment and unconditional love for humanity. And one of the things that happens is when we see these types of natural disasters taking place, we always see people helping one another, no matter what their, you know, feelings are about other things in life you know it doesn't matter they put all that aside in order to be just plain old good people and it's a wonderful thing now we have an aspect that's happening today that's going to make it an even better day all right because we're coming up at the end of the month here some of you may be looking for a new place to live and wondering is this where i should go you know maybe you're renting or something it's a good day to sign all right this is a card of success the ace of cups it represents success and creativity this aspect is mercury trine jupiter right positive thoughts and communication and optimism just that cup is just overflowing with optimism today now i know life isn't all peachy keen all the time and things are never perfect but one of the things i love about this card is that it always reminds us to look for what is good to look for the optimism right optimists and pessimists this is very much the optimist pessimist card okay more so than any other i can think of because it's about perception and how you view things is the cup half full or is it half empty you know those who feel that it's half empty they're the pessimists that they have full of course they're the optimist and me i'm like a super believer i always say the cup can be refilled and that's something important that we need to remember all of the time so no matter what your perception is above all you need to remember that you know even if something has spilled from the cup and you can you can fill it back up again and you have the universe on your side today to help you to do that I really feel that while, you know, no, maybe it may not be the best day of your life or anything like that, but I think that if you look today, you can find the things, you know, for which you can be thankful and optimistic about your outlook in life, all right? I'm thinking yesterday a friend messaged me and was, you know, telling me about, you know, paperwork for her home and being able to, you know, get a loan in order to redo the house the way she wanted a perfect day to make that commitment all right so there's a lot that's happening here you just need to look for those rainbows and that abundance because it is available to you right now i want to thank you all very much for being here i'll see you here again tomorrow and as always have a great day